my channel. Today we're going to review uh, USB.3 portable external hard drive by company name Vibra. By Pro, as I was corrected earlier. But um, yeah, let's get the, um, the unpacking. Let's unveil. Cause it's called unveil for one. Kind of ripped. I ripped it up a little bit. That's all right. All right. So that's the box. Um, brings a couple stuff. Let's read, let's read the description first. I'm learning body for better cooling and protect it. So it's basically plug and play. Uh, most stuff nowadays are plug and play. Um, USB powered bus, no external power needed. So it's powered by USB. Uh, 3.0 USB. Five gigabytes per second transfer rate. Backward comp batter, comp pat, comp. And it's compact size. Um, what the package con contains is the external hard drive. It's just a shell and the connecting cable and carrying case. Support DC, laptop, or Mac system with a free USB port. Most computers should have at least one USB port. All right, let's get into this. So, external drive, manual, manuals are very important. We have the 3.0 USB screwdriver. Let's look at the manual real quick. Basic uh, setup for the hardware, package contents, stuff like that, all that good stuff, caution about uh, file system and formats, how to format it. Um, basically it just says just file it to FAT32 format, which is the more. It'll be a link in my description, so you could purchase it if you want to. Right. Basically what you want to do is, is to get this baby propped in right. All right, so all this is gonna be in a small little package. The deep that I did not see earlier because I already put this together beforehand because I was too excited. So you basically pop it right in. You pop it right in. Take any any hard drive. Oh, this is a two two point five hard drive. SATA drive, 80 gigabytes, 5,400 RPM, pretty good. It's all right. Ripped it from my old laptop I used to have. Just pull this bad boy out. Stop me breaking it, hopefully. We'll go it out. Plug it in. Make sure everything's nice and sturdy. Make sure it's the part with the LED. There's two LEDs in right there. So you can try to see if you can like zoom into that. There's gonna be two LEDs right here that'll light up once you plug it in. So then after that, just put it in back to screw. Let's plug this bad boy in. All right. So you want to plug this into any USB port, basically. Bad boy in here. My dinosaur Mac. It's actually pretty good for the time being. All right, so you plug it in, and you see these LEDs pop up. You want to put it into the USB port that's a USB 3.0, not the 2.0. Cause then it won't, it won't get, it won't charge up. So once you plug it in, you see. Let me do this again. Just eject it. 
eject it, unplug, plug in, you hear it go on, LEDs start flashing, you're good to go. And that's my review. If you want to go ahead and buy it, go ahead. Um, there's better drives out there you can use. There's the solid state drives. You can put a uh, 2.5 solid state drive in here and you'll be all right. All right, so that's my review, guys. Subscribe, like, thank you.